Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel and I'm excited to share with you different kind of tips on outfit ideas for a ballet flats as your shoes. My recent obsession of ballet flats has been kind of really really crazy. So I got this one. This is from a trendy, woman's trendy fashion, I think. I'll just put the name of it below here. And this one is such a nice, amazing ballet flats. It's nice and clean and black. And it has beautiful foam here and then a nice soft foam sole. And it's so versatile and not really hard to wear in. You don't really need to wear it in. That's why I've been obsessed with it. And I really wanted to play around different kind of styles for this. So here is the different kind of styles for your ballet flats. So let's start with the first outfit. So the first outfit is this beautiful black shirt. Now I am going to recommend to you guys on your kind of versions of your shirt, but I would suggest a bit, a bit of few tips on how to incorporate those kind of shirts. So this is a nice black shirt with a few textures and details in it. And then it's, but it is mainly plain. And then I just add some gold accessories. And then this skirt, that's why I'm going to explain this. This is a nice patterned skirt. Now I've actually gained a few weight a bit on some areas so i wanted to hide it so with a nice busy pattern skirt like this it kind of hides that area and kind of subtle and then since i'm combining it with the black and white combination it's kind of subtle and not too much but it actually hides and that nice kind of silhouette now this skirt is nice and poofy and some of the things that i get to buy the skirt from is actually from the visoria i don't know if you could see, easily see this in shopee you could try to screenshot it and show it in Shopee and then maybe there's like an image search but aside from that a simple black tights that I got from the SM department store and then my beautiful ballet flats so this is classic and like the typical Chanel kind of vibe but in a different aura to it I would suggest this beautiful Dior inspired bag from Nicole this is not sponsored but this is a beautiful kind of pair and it's kind of like chic but simple and not too much so that is the first step. Now the next beautiful outfit that's simple and not too much is try to find a nice red or pop-up collar kind of long shirt that is like this one. Although I put actually a bit of shorts here just in case I don't want to you know flash you guys but a nice long shirt with this but not too long. It's like it's going to be on the mid part of your thigh. It's going to look chic also and if you think it's too much and you don't want to wear shorts underneath just wear cycling you can add this kind of beautiful detail which is a leather jacket this leather jacket adds that little bit of subtle kind of different texture layering it with the red color and of course the nice shiny jacket so this kind of look is adding the layer of the black leather shirt black leather jacket and then with a nice short red outfit now the red shirt or the short red pop of color that you're going to have adds a bit of layer and flair to that black leather shirt and then your tights and your black ballerina flat now the next outfit is this beautiful kind of lacy kind of dress now this is very long for my liking but although this kind of plain look is actually really nice already it's simple but to add a bit of style to it so i'm going to put this kelly inspired belt or kelly yeah kelly inspired belt and then i'm going to pull it here so it has a bit of I'm gonna pull it up a bit so it adds a bit of shape to my body aside from that it shows and elongates my legs more now this one has a nice detail because it's nice and sheer here this one i was lucky enough to actually thrift this and honestly it's a nice fit it's loose enough and it kind of hides you know every little bump that you don't want of that is obvious in your body then aside from that just add some simple accessories and this one is such a cute outfit on its own but to add a little flair of it, you can either have this Lady Dior inspired bag. You can also add this little beautiful white bag. Now this is also cute and unique because it adds a little flair to that kind of edgy kind of look. Or sometimes you could just mold on a different kind of bag. So this is subtle enough on its own. It's a really cute outfit. Simple with a nice sheer. You can put it on a party. It's also good for the office. And it's just classic and all black, but kind of that little detail that adds a little twist to it. Now, one of my favorite combinations that I love is this beautiful straight leg or yeah, straight leg mom jeans kind of black 
charcoal vibe of a pants that's high waisted so it really cinches the stomach and then of course it gives a nice little silhouette to the booty and then a nice pop of color of red then you add that beautiful ballet class so this is classic i think it's kind of like a mom look but you can upgrade it with like this top you can actually make it like this so it's nice more like kind of girly more formal maybe for a night out and then you can also just make it more formal like this so this kind of outfit is simple and versatile plus you can just switch up the bottom to a different kind of look and then the outfit that's next to pair it if you don't want to wear pants is actually these beautiful high-waisted shorts now this one i can actually really link down below because i got this from ona collection they have so many colors and so many sizes for this so there is the for the petite size it's up to i think 32 and then 31 to 36 when it comes to the bigger ones with the bigger hips so this one i got it and it still fits me the in the medium or the petite size but this is already stretching me a whole lot but it actually looks good with a nice silhouette and then your pop of colored of shirt and then your nice ballet flats so this is like casual date night with your girls or maybe date night with your partner now this beautiful combination is a classic and one of my favorites which is a red tight shirt and then a nice black flowy skirt now this is very classic and a lot of people actually love wearing this but it's like the whole homage to the ballet kind of feel but you just add a bit more accessories maybe change the top into a bit more formal for something that will be different and then a nice flowy skirt that's why i actually opt for also a flowy skirt instead of just the shorts or a tighter pencil skirt because it's just like the shorts it's going to be the same vibe but if you're going to wear a pencil skirt but with the flowy, it kind of hides a little bit of the tummy or a little bit of the layers that you want to hide. And it cinches in here and it adds a little more volume to your hips. So that's kind of the idea and tips for this kind of outfit. And that's about it, you guys, for the different kind of tips for that kind of ballet flats feel. And you can really, really change it up with colors and different kind of style and what you prefer as a skirt, what you prefer as your style of shorts. But make sure you balance the silhouette of whatever is tighter and whatever is bigger. And then what you want to make to hide more and then what you want to make it more evident. So those are the different kind of tips on how you're going to play around with the ballet flats and those kind of combinations with your outfit. I hope you like this video. If you do, please like and subscribe down below. Don't forget to hit the bell button and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye!